from all of us at American Eagle, we would like to wish Liam a very happy birthday sitting in seat 16A. We do hope you have a great birthday. <laughs> happy birthday. Hey, Liam. Hey, Liam. Hey, Liam. Hey, Liam. Hey, Liam. Hey, Liam. Nice. This is us, bro. Good. This car is really fun, guys. Yeah. We are in Buffalo, New York for Liam's 13th birthday trip. We do this, if you're not following or familiar, uh, every time one of our kids turns 13, they get a special dad trip. And uh, so far, like Reese and Kira and Penelope all chose New York, uh, New York City. Kira did her own spin and did like a Connecticut Gilmore Girls Tour thing. Jude did Yosemite, and Liam chose Niagara Falls. So it's going to be an interesting experience because we can't go to the Canada side of Niagara, <laughs> but uh, we're going to do the American side, and then obviously the Buffalo Wings here. Yeah. Yes. We're going to be doing uh, mini buffalo wings. So pretty excited about that. And uh, so I think we're going to go right now, actually. We're pretty hungry and thirsty. And uh, go to Anchor Bar and eat some wings for lunch. So it was an early day today. We, we left at 5.45-ish uh, uh, to get here and uh, got to sleep a little on the plane and all that good stuff. But we're going we're gonna to head out. So this is the most fun part. Check this out. Start the car. <laughs> I've always wanted a push button start. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Where it all started. Where the greatest food of all time was invented. Home of the original buffalo wing. Started right here. Invented in this building. Oh man. What's that? Wings. <laughs> of course. <laughs> it does smell so good. Holy cow, man. It smells spicy. It does smell spicy. It smells like the original buffalo wing. It smells like they've been doing this for a while. <laughs> That mild. I want to. I want to see you. Uh, I want to see you chomp into the first one. You get to take the inaugural bite, bro. This is your deal, bro. What you think? <laughs> All right, man. Is your life transformed forever? Amazing. <laughs> Here at our ye old Airbnb. This, this house was built in the 1800s, man. How crazy is this? Yeah, this is it. It is a Buffalo neighborhood landmark, the White House. Baby Ruth. Dang. 1893. Pretty cool, man. Dude, this is rad, man. Heck yeah, that's a great bed. Little fireplace right here. This gonna be your bed? <laughs> Let's see what else is in here. Nice TV. Oh, what's up, Buffalo, New York? Good to see you. This is where the locals get their wings. We got Gabriel's Gate, Doc Sullivan's Duff's. Very cool. Yeah, and also the Anchor Bar where we just went. Yeah. Not bad. Thank you, Airbnb hosts. I'm grateful for those tips. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> All right, we are walking around downtown Buffalo. It's a pretty rad downtown, don't you think, bud? Yeah. <laughs> a lot of really cool architecture. We're just kind of seeing all kinds of stuff, and I'm teaching Liam how to use the camera so he can be Mr. Photographer. You're doing pretty well, huh? Yeah. Killing it. He's a he's already a professional, guys. Guns. Like Look at those mine. guns. <laughs> this is cool, huh? What do you think? You want to fly that jet right there? A little fighter, fighter jet. Pretty cool. Dude, check out this anchor right here. <laughs> it's like uh, Thor's hammer. You think you can lift it up? Are you worthy? Think you can pick it up? <laughs> You're gonna have to get out there. <laughs> oh, it's, it's in the cement. They put in. Ah, oh, it's cemented in. Well, then you're just gonna have to be even more worthy. Yeah. It weighs seven tons. Though. It weighs seven tons. Holy cow! I mean, I guess it's got to be pretty heavy to like keep a big old ship like that, yeah. you know, anchored down. Guys, this canal side was so cool, yeah. and uh, the the clouds actually went away. So it looks yeah. like tonight we're gonna have some sunsets, some like real sunset. So we're headed to Niagara Falls tonight. Yeah. We know that it's lit up super cool at night, and so we have a lot of plans to be there. Basically all day tomorrow, yeah. we're gonna go. Uh, we're gonna do. There is a, a, a made of the mist sort of boat where you yes. go up I'm under so the falls. Excited. And then there's also a, pl uh, a way, like it's an elevator that takes you basically to the base of the falls called Cave of the Winds. Uh, and so we're going to do both of those. So it's going to be a long day at Niagara tomorrow. And yes. we're probably going to be exhausted by the time it gets dark uh, to see the evening, light, the night lights. Uh, so we decided to go ahead and do it tonight. And then we're going to come back for round two of Wings, yes. FaceTime Amanda and the kids, and, uh, and then sleep to get some rest for a long day tomorrow. So. So, you having fun, buddy? Yeah. It's pretty rock and roll, huh? Mm -hmm. Feels so good here, too. Woo! Let's go. You can hear it from like a mile away. It's it pretty crazy. Cold. Oh my gosh, it just got really cold. Yeah. We walked through those gates and it got really cold. Wow. There's Ontario right there. The Canadian side, eh? Dad, you notice that dude wore this jacket for his trip. Now I'm wearing it. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's true. I remember that. That's funny. <laughs> Come here. What's up? There's an iceberg of ice. Now. There's an iceberg of ice? Show me. Ice. Oh my gosh. I think. Dude, that's crazy, man. Look at this. That is insane. We're going in there We're going to go down there tomorrow, bro. It's just so much mist. And it is so freaking and cold. And there's a spot down there that we're going to be literally standing <laughs> We're going to We're going to have like, we're going to be in a boat like right there. Just like getting drenched in freezing cold in mist. the cave of, what's it called again? The cave of winds. Yeah. Right Cave of the so wind. You can just get right under it. <laughs> we're gonna and just get <laughs> We're gonna need to bring some extra clothes for sure. Yeah. And just be ready to be freezing for a while. It's okay with me though. Yeah, look at that man. That's so cold, the snow down there. That's insane. Wow. Guess where I am right now. <laughs> where are you? Alright, now flip the screen around. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty cool, Mom. Tomorrow. We decided to go today to see the sunset at it. Get ready to get your mind blown by something very cool. Ready? <laughs> and over there's Canada. Yeah, that's old Canada. And there's also a thing called the Cave of the Winds that you can like climb down into it, basically. 
so we're gonna go get very very cold the water still has like chunks of ice it looks like icebergs in it hey hi, buddy Binky. hey Binky hi hi <laughs> hi hi all right we have waited for the sun to go down so we could see this all lit up and man it's so cool it's so cool <laughs> I made a good choice. You made a very good choice, my friend. <laughs> Alright, beautiful people, it is the next morning now, and uh, we're headed to get some coffee because life runs on coffee, right? You having fun, bro? Yeah. Yeah? Awesome. <laughs> Thank you, good tonight. Alright brother, chart a course for Niagara Falls. Okay. Engage. Alright, we're back at Niagara. It's gonna be so much fun. We're gonna go on the Maid of the Mist. And we're also gonna go in the Cave of Winds and get soaking wet. Good thing we got an extra pair of clothes. The Cave of Wonders. You ready? I was born ready, bro. Born ready. You ready to see the greatest thing ever in the world? <laughs> the one of the great wonders of the natural world. Mm-hmm. Apparently it is. It's either number seven or an honorary eighth. Uh, we read this yesterday. Yeah. And you have to believe the internet. You have to believe everything <laughs> that's on the internet. Abraham Lincoln said that actually. Really? Yeah. I just found that quote Ab from Spider-Man. <laughs> Abraham Lincoln said, believe everything you read on the internet. Wow. I read that on the internet. because um, the Maid of the Mist is like closed for like another week while they wait for the ice to thaw. We barely missed it, guys. Ugh. But uh, we think we can still make it over to the Cave of the Mists. Uh, there's just a little walking bridge right here and we're gonna kind of walk across it and see if we can't do that. Hey, it's a Cave of the Mists, not one. Cave of the Winds, not Cave of the Mists. Whatever, same thing. <laughs> Same thing. So we're gonna walk across that bridge, see if we can't get over, get down into it and see what happens. It's pretty, it's pretty icy down there, not gonna lie. So the actual path might be iced over. I'm not sure. We're here a little early. There's like nobody here. So uh, I'm guessing they knew something we didn't know. The, the falls are still unbelievably gorgeous. Probably one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. Uh, would you agree with that? Yeah. Yeah. I like just second. Huh? Second. Second? To the Grand Canyon? Yeah. <laughs> he likes the Grand Canyon better. No worries. But uh, that's one of the wonders of the world. This is one of the wonders of the world. So we're gonna walk across this bridge, see what we can do. Cave of the Winds, let's go. It's unreal. Those rapids are moving so rapidly. Dude, look at this. Holy cow, man. Wow. Oh my gosh. Stud. You're a stud. Hey. Looks like we get to do Cave of the Winds, bro. Are you stoked? <laughs> we got 30 minutes, 40, 40 minutes before we can go. Yeah, I guess this is about as close as we're going to get to the uh, Horseshoe Falls. It's still amazing, though. Down there, just head straight down the tunnel and then keep okay. right outside. Sounds good, thank you. You're welcome. Going down 175 feet, bro. <laughs> Are you stoked? Me too. <laughs> wow. Oh, these birds. There's so many. Mine, 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 mine. <laughs> Pretty crazy, huh? Wow.
Guys, I thought that was pretty freaking cool. There was a lot of the, the actual path that was still frozen over and a lot of the path that had been actually like broken and needed to be repaired. There were some guys doing some repairs there. But it was really cool to be like down in the falls. It was, we definitely got wet. My hair is pretty drenched, so I'm wearing a hat now. And <laughs> Liam too. <laughs> What'd you think of that, bud? Very cool. Very cool, huh? That rainbow is amazing. <laughs> Isn't that crazy, bro? Yeah. It's incredible. I wish we could get down here on this observation deck right there. That's a, that's like so close. That's like right up on it. But there's so much ice, they've closed it off. That's incredible. All right, guys, we had a blast at Niagara Falls. I think we're gonna go back tonight yeah. again because <laughs> Liam wants to go back for the night lights again, which, yeah. So cool. It was so rad last night, and that's why we came here, guys, is to go to Niagara, so um, can't get enough of it. It's pretty pretty rad, but we're getting pretty hungry, and uh, so I think we're going to go for wings round three. Four. Uh, technically round four, yeah, I guess so, because we had leftover wings for <laughs> breakfast this morning. <laughs> it's our favorite food, guys. It's so, so good, so we're uh, we're enjoying that a lot, and uh, did Anchor Bar for lunch yesterday, Gabriel's Gates wings last night. <laughs> Oh, freaking amazing. It was so good. Probably the best wings I've ever had in my life, I think. And we didn't vlog it, but it was incredible. We took pictures. We did take some pictures. Maybe I'll put a picture of that right there. But um, I think we're going to go to Duff's right now because a lot of you guys have told us on Instagram that like that's one of the big places to go. And there's one not too far from here. So yeah. we're kind of letting all the wing places duke it out, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, who's who's going to be the best wing to win, you know? Right now, Gabriel's gates in the in the in the lead, but uh, mm -hmm. they may have to duke it out. Gabe, Gabe, and du and Duff might have to duke it out a little bit. Yeah. So we'll see. You hungry? You wanna go get some food? Mm -hmm. Let's go. Well, guys, we are back in Buffalo. We're just walking around downtown. I'm kind of just amazed. There are so many, just absolutely stunning church buildings like old cathedrals old basilicas gorgeous churches like look at this isn't that incredible and i don't even think it's a church anymore i think it's like an art museum now but i'm so impressed isn't that amazing dude what do you think should we like buy one of those and make it into one of our houses should we make it into a haunted house make it into a haunted it'll have to be haunted to be haunted sorry no walk-ins at this time we're getting the drone up, and I'm flying it. <laughs> We're wanting to fly the drone up there. Cool build. Okay, you're in the tree. <laughs> well, it landed in the tree. <laughs> you gotta look out for that stuff. <laughs> I think we can get it. You think I should lift you up? You want me to lift you up? All right, we are back at the falls. It is dark, and they are Russian. Actually, American, but uh, you know what I mean. This is actually way cooler now. It's a little darker. We didn't really, we came a little too early yesterday, I think, you know? So the lights weren't quite as dramatic, but this is amazing. It looks so cool. And then back here at the back, you've got the Horseshoe Falls with a whole different set of colors. Covered in fog, um, fog, right? It's just mean, mist, right? yeah, so much mist everywhere. The light's just illuminating it all. All right, bro, it's our last day heading home. <laughs> You've been talking about wanting to see Ethan nonstop on this trip. It's like, bro, we're in Niagara, and you're just like, I miss Ethan. 
<laughs> I miss mom and all the other kids, obviously. But I'm ready to go home and see everybody. We've had fun for sure, huh? Yeah. Yeah. So we're just packing up here at the Airbnb. It's been an awesome time here. Pretty cool Airbnb. We really liked it. And uh, so just packing up, get ready to go home, see Amanda and the kids. And uh, really grateful. You know, Amanda, like... It really is such a sacrifice for her to let us be able to do these kinds of things, um, whether it's just, you know, a one-on-one -on -one trip with that or or any kind of anything like that. When you have seven kids, like, for a mom to be able to stay home and hold down the fort and really take care of things, like, she's amazing. So we're really excited to get to go home and see them. And uh, do you have fun, buddy? Yeah. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Me too. I kind of like this guy, guys. <laughs> kind of? Your my new nickname for you is Liam the Great, because there's so much greatness in you, my man. Like, you're a total stud. <laughs> Liam the Great. I'm gonna start calling you that. Is that all right? Yeah, I'll start calling you Dad the Great. Dad the Great. <laughs> Liam the Great, this hereby concludes our buffalo adventure, but by no means concludes our adventure of life, for we shall never settle for a mediocre life. We shall never settle for just coasting. We shall evermore be adventurers on this journey. We shall forevermore maintain our thirst for life. Carpe diem, I say. Seize the day. Seize the day, boy. Make your life extraordinary. <laughs> you weird? <laughs> I'm weird. Yes, yes I am. Yes, you are I'd rather have it no other way. enjoy having them home and just spend time as a family this evening so we're gonna go ahead and turn off the cameras but we yeah, love you guys yeah. so much thanks for joining <laughs> these guys on a Bye. super yes. special trip it was so awesome wasn't yeah. it Liam Amazing. I can't wait to see all the footage it's gonna be so so awesome be yeah we love you guys we'll see you next time bye bye bye, bye. 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 For your namesake, you will lead me 